Greetings and salutations, dear viewers. I am Nakatalili, and I am here to give you my maiden reactions to the Wolf Pack. Rated PC 13 for profound carnage. Now, the Wolf Pack is a collection of three games that you get together on Steam, including Wolfenstein 3D, the Spear of Destiny, is it Spear of Destiny? Something like Spear of Destiny, and Return to Castle Wolfenstein. Let's hit buttons. Now, the of course, we're going to be showing all of them, and to be perfectly honest, I've played Wolfenstein 3D before, I've played Spear of Destiny before, so it's not so much a maiden reaction to those, but I'm still showing it all off. However, I've not played Return to Castle Wolfenstein, so that's probably going to be where, like, the proper maiden reactions start. Admittedly, I am kind of using this as an excuse to play Wolfenstein. Now, from what I've discovered, um, oddly enough, when you get the Wolf Pack on Steam, you get Return to Castle Wolfenstein, which is pretty alright, the, the Wolfenstein 3D and um, Spear of Destiny, though, they actually give you a straight-up, like, ROM to the game and DOS box. I mean, you run it through Steam, but what it's doing is playing a ROM of the game through DOS box. It's not a port, it's nothing. This is straight-up the original game. Which, I think that's gonna be, like, it's gonna do worlds for how great it's gonna be. Um, it does give you a couple dilemmas in dealing with DOSBox, though, because first of all, DOSBox, when I say I hate intrusive full screens, and how I've mentioned that there are some full screens that are less intrusive than others, DOSBox has a stupid intrusive full screen. So, actually, a small tip to everybody, before you boot the game up, if you minimize everything, then boot it up, then unwindow it, then unminimize things, it actually doesn't jank up all your windows. So, point of advice there. Also, the frustrating thing here is, since it is DOSBox, there aren't any, like, straight-up configurations you can do. Like, I can't go around here and change it, the window resolution. You have to change them through the DOSBox config files. A little troublesome, but you know what, I'll give them that. The troublesome thing is, I couldn't figure out how to turn off auto full screen. I found websites and guides that say, hey, change this, and it will change your... It will change that setting and make it not auto full screen, and then it still did. I've changed it in, like, four places, and it still does. So yeah, that's a thing. But that aside... Wolfenstein 3D! Now, I have no idea what the controls are. Mouse enabled? I'm alright with mouse. Do I got a mouse? I can do mouse on this menu. That is... that is funky. Now, this being originally a computer game, I imagine... Okay, button two, fires button one... How do I... What, can I change these? Open. I don't know. Let's go with that button. Fire. That button. Strafe. That button. Okay. Keyboard. Being an originally a keyboard or a computer game, it's kind of designed for computers, so that works. Left is left, right is right, forward is up, backwards is down. Well, that makes sense. Run is right shift. You know, I don't like that at all. I'm changing this to WASD. I can't change it to WASD. Oh no, I can't, okay. It's just funky, a little. Run! Left shift, open, space, fire, I don't care, strafe. Oh man, I like strafe everywhere. I, 
I'm hoping strafing works all right. I honestly don't know. I don't like, like, the left and right. I tend to use mouse look. So I wouldn't change left and right to strafe left and right. You know what? Let's just go with that and see what happens. Give you all of the episodes, so that's pretty all right. Oh man, look at him, he's a baby. Get psyched! I'm probably gonna die, because I haven't played this game in forever and I forget how to play it. Oh man, I can't strafe! Also, the um, video is funky, so give me a second. Control, where is it? Change view. All of the view! There we go, now we can see. Well, I apparently murdered a guard. Oh, I'm moving with the mouse. Ah. I can't strafe either, so this is kind of terrible. I really want to strafe. I saw you. Okay, I'm gonna have to start doing, like, that or something, because... You also move with the mouse. There have got to be settings to turn this crap off. This is just annoying. I mean, I guess it's control. There has got to be, like, options to turn this off. I want to turn off mouse move, and I want to make it so, like, left and right is strafe left and right. I don't think I can, though, and that may just be the limitations of the game. That's going to be troublesome. Yeah, I guess we can't really deal with it. All right, well, let's get... let's just do what we can with what we got. Limitations of an old game. I think this is where actually, like, updating it would have helped. There are dead guys in here. Now, it's been mentioned before, but I am a fan of first-person shooters. No, you don't. Open your sorry butt back up. I know there's guys in there. I know there's guys in there. Okay, so there aren't guys in there. All right. All right, there aren't guys in there. Dog! Dog! Demon dog! Why am I wasting multiple... I've... I'm... I've killed every enemy so far with one bullet except for the dog, and I've wasted at least two bullets on them. Like, the first bullet has hit them every time. Can I have ammo? I want ammo. I want to know why the Nazis have, like, a well right in the middle of their fortress. Mmm, dog food. But Wolfenstein, Wolfenstein, you could almost say Wolfenstein is, like, the father of all FPSs. This is kind of where they all began. Ah, oh, crap. And I love it for being just its basic, nothing special self. It's a quick, it's run and gun, it's just you and dudes and guns, and you using guns on dudes. In fact, if you're going more than a couple seconds without using a gun on a dude, you're kind of playing the game wrong. Silly German laugh, or silly German scream. I laugh. He dies. And I still instinctively want to use left and right as strafe, left and right, and I'm not getting it. Is 
Is there a map in this game? I don't think there's a map in this game either. Nope. This game was before maps. This game is pre-map. Is there a guy down there too? Nope, just him. Ow. Dang it, you jerk. First guy to hit me so far, and you hit me from way the crap over there. I will save that meat. Ah! I really want to find... I really want to find some of the SS guys. They're wearing blue outfits. They're blue- they're wearing blue outfits, and when they- you kill them, they go, Mein Lieben! Which I think is just hilarious for completely unrelated reasons. I forget what Mein Lieben translates to. I think it translates to my life. So it's like, oh no, you have killed me, and I have been- I have been lifted of that which keeps me living. I think it's funny, though, because it sounds like they're saying, I'm leaving. I'm leaving! Yeah, you're leaving, alright. Man, I should've explored more. Get psyched! Heck yeah. Freaking dogs. I feel very insecure without a run button. Or, no, without a, uh, strength. I'm thinking of changing sh shift to strafe, actually. No dog in this one, actually. Surprisingly, no dog in that one. Okay, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna change shift to strafe since I never run. Let's see here, um, yeah, strafe... No, I wanna keep playing! Look at me strafe! Look at me strafe! Guy? No, it's not. I can strafe now. Freaking Nazis ain't got nothing on me. No! Yes! Well, I've accomplished all I wanted to accomplish here. And you get a new gun from them, too, because they're, like, big and nasty and have guns and stuff. Pete say kill him. He's like right there. This is an automatic weapon, but I don't like wasting ammo. Do they know how to open doors? Or are they too dumb to open doors? got a funny cough, too, when he dies. It's kinda great. I 
I have no idea where I'm going. Now, I will say, I have played the, um... Really, I went all this way and there's nothing here. I have played the, um... I think they ported this game to the Game Boy Advance, and they added a lot of nice things to it. And if anybody's all actually interested in playing this game, I would recommend that version. It's actually pretty darn good. It's got mini-maps and everything. And it's all full of not getting lost. Well, now I am kind of lost. I am going to be taking a look at the other two games. I'm going to try to cut this one a little bit short. Because, really, I just kind of want to play the game. And I know I'm going the wrong way. Crap, I'm lost. No, wait, that's where I fought the SS guy. Isn't it? I think that's where I fought the SS guy. You know what? I'm lost and I don't care. So, let's go ahead and call this one and then go take a look at, um... Let's go ahead and take a look at Spear of Destiny. So, given that, I will be back in just a moment. I just have to go over here and actually start it up. Starts up pretty quick. Now, Spear of Destiny... Let's see how much this just absolutely destroys the stream. Now yeah, we're doing pretty all right for the most part. Now, Spear of Destiny, it is the it's technically a prequel to the original. Okay, so now that I know how the controls work, I'm pretty sure this runs on the exact same control scheme, so... Open! I don't know, let's go with that button. Fire! Strafe! Keyboard! Run! Left is that button. Run is that button. Fire is... I don't care. Strafe is that button. It's running on... I'm pretty sure this is the same unchanged engine. So I don't think there's going to be too much in this game. Different from before. So we will discover... Ooh, I am... I've broken into a place! We can see it outside! And there are vines everywhere, and I can't see crap. <laughs> Sneaking up on me, piece of crap. And my inability to strafe is certainly not helping matters. I mean, I know I can, like, technically strafe, but it's not easy. Ooh, new textures. <laughs> wow! He just straight up murdered me. Let's try that one again. I like it when I have controls that, like, are easier to use. Oh. And now I'm all out of ammo. Because I killed two guys. No, I have ammo now. I want to kill him. I really do. Controls are not unawkward. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. I'm not strafing like I really want to strafe. Coming out, big guy. I'm not strafing like I really want to strafe, and now I'm stabbing him. I will straight up stab you. Okay, yeah, the, um, the strafing is terrible. I, like, I can't 
fight. I almost can't play this game in an intelligent way because I can't strafe in an intelligent way. Let's just leave him there. Come back to him a little later. I got new textures and stuff. And of course, the strafing more or less prevents me from being able to, like, sneak up on a guy around a corner. Oh. Hey, I found the end of the stage. How about that? I guess all three of these led to the same place. I guess they just like really fancy doors. <laughs> Strafing is not working how I really want it to! Ah! I, I can't do this. I really can't. With the strafing like that, I can't do this. Not because it's terrible, but because it's ingrained into me. So, when I need to, like, on the spur of the moment, make a decision and, like, I need to dodge this way real quick, I need to do this, I need to do this, my brain does not... My brain is too used to being able to strafe that way. So, this is going to be, I mean, it's going to be a test of me getting used to new controls. Like, if I could, if I could strafe, this would be a lot more doable. Not because... And again, not because, like, this is terrible and the controls are that bad, but because my brain inherently treats controls that way. And whereas I understand how I need to do it and how to strafe, at the spur of the moment my brain just can't do it. So it's like every time I fight one of those guys, I back into the main room, I try to dance around and do my little thing to fight, and I end up doing, like, I need to strafe to the left, so I do this. Which is really helpful when you're trying to dodge. This is, like, the opposite of helpful when I'm trying to dodge. So, yeah. Also, mouse move is on, and I like the mouse look, but the mouse move, like the forward and backwards, I don't like it all. Don't like it. For a couple of reasons. I mean, it's not like bad, but it'll be like, I just need to adjust the mouse and get it into position, and I'm doing this, just because I want to like move the mouse a little bit. You monster. I got a crown. All of the treasure! Okay, where have I been and where have I not been? Hey, a door! I don't have a key. So, I guess that means I've been in all of these, right? Yeah. Okay, can I... Is there any time saving? That's actually a good question. Is there any time saving? as there usually is. Yes, there is! So I can just hop right back here. Well, that's good to know. If I don't go all the way over there, he won't bother me. Oh. I got a whole big box of bullets. I got a big old box of bullets. Okay, now I'm back in here. 
Now let's go over here. I will beat the first level of this game. Crap. Yeah, you're leaving, all right. You know what? Good time to save. No, I don't want to. I want to go back to game. The menu UI is a little bit slow for that kind of quick saving. Spamming, which I'm also prone to do. These have the same ammo. I see no one, so I'm gonna wait for the door to close. There's the end. However, there is yet another SS troop that I really want to kill. I could use some meat or something, though. Are there any meat laying around? Just like a chicken leg or something? Well, I'm pretty sure I can take him, now that I have this gun. Eat it! Okay, let's get the crap out of here. That bumping you're hearing, by the way, is me, like, bumping against the wall. Which apparently happens even if I just kind of brush against it. What can I say? It's an old game. Boosh! Okay, that said, we are on stage two. Ooh. All right, we're in stage two, and that place looks red, so I'm actually kind of curious. Okay, it's just bricks. So let's go ahead and call this one, and we will boot up. Return to Castle Wolfenstein. So I'll be uh, right back in a moment. Heinrich, your reign of terror must end. You fool! You know as well as I that I cannot be destroyed.
May the fates hold off the coming of the storm. to Castle Wolfenstein immediately. Notify Herr Himmler. We've found him. So that's a thing. I have mouse. Actually, real quick. Let me lower the volume just a little bit for all y'all, because I get the feeling this one's going to be a little bit louder than the others. Now, this game, once it, this game, just as the others, it did start in full screen, but you can fix it easier, and it works. So, yeah, there's a thing. Ah, these buttons are confusing. I'm going to ignore them. W, A, S, D, move left and move right. All right, so we're already default strafing left and right. I can lean. Jump is space, crouch is C. Shoot buttons, attack or mouse one. The default buttons are actually really nice. I don't think I have to change anything, so that's actually looking like a plus. And seeing as, seeing as this is kind of a last-gen game, I'm hoping I won't have to fraps it, because getting the other games in with this one, and frapsing like only one of them, would be a real pain in the butt. Now, one of the uh, bigger things about Wolf, uh, Return to Castle Wolfenstein was actually the multiplayer, which was competitive multiplayer deathmatch style, I'm pretty sure. I think there may have been cooperative, but I don't know. I'm not big on multiplayer, and I figure I probably shouldn't try to judge something that I don't know crap about, because then I'm just gonna sound like an idiot. Okay, systems. You can't. You do have a fair number of video resolutions. Choose whether to run it in full screen or not. I mean, overall, it looks pretty decent. So I guess let's see how the game holds up. He looks funny. And of course there are cutscenes. Or, wait, no, do I have to... There are kind of cutscenes. Come in. Yes, Mr. President. I will kill Robo Hitler for you. Well, Jack, have we heard anything? Have I mentioned Robo Hitler is yes, like an actual boss in Kessler, Wolfenstein 3D? Circle. And both agents have been captured. Not this They're game, but like, Wolfenstein. yeah, seriously. I mean, Damn. it's pretty great. Quarter meeting, Jack. Yes, sir. Not this game, but in the original Wolfenstein 3D, he was like the last oh, boss right, of one of the chapters. It was a giant mechanical suit with chain numbers. guns for arms and like a jar with Hitler's head in it. Well, here's what we know. It's pretty great. This is Castle Wolfenstein, located it actually, in the surprisingly, was not the final boss. Of the final boss now, was like his like head of military of or something, and then you had to fight like but we've only recently heard you had to fight like necromancer Hitler. In the German resistance regarding I seriously cannot make this crap up. There. I mean, you can't get much more awesome well, these than this. These are part of Himmler's newly formed SS Paranormal Division, a small but elite group comprised of members possessing above average IQs and backgrounds with the occult and or paranormal. The one in charge is this woman. Helga von Bülow. Our Kreisau contact in one of the villages below the castle has informed us that she and other members of the division have been recently deployed to the area. 
I get the Crowd feeling the she could kill me pretty easily. Strasse, also known as Death's Head, a brilliant, ruthless scientist who heads up Himmler's Special Projects Division. Special Projects? <laughs> it's marvelously vague. Well, we know it encompasses all manner of advanced weapons research, including rocketry. It involves it's also dead guys, to involve too. Ultra secret research into chemical and biological warfare. Charming. Yeah, I mean, they did a lot of stuff. I mean, there was, I mean, there was Robo Hitler, Necromancer Hitler. He could, like, they could make these super soldiers by, like, altering their genetics and crap. I mean, like. Still doesn't add up. Well, that's why we said our boys This is not a realistic approach to uh, World War II, if you hadn't guessed. This is like an absolutely yeah. fantastic approach to the history of well, World we War II. Send a backup team in behind. This is how World War II oh, should have oh, been. We sit tight and hope that they can find a way out. It's your call, sir. Well, looks like we play the waiting game. And then we were loading. Mission one! Now I know we are something of a double agent, a spy or something, so we're like a guy. That scream, man. That scream. Oh, that was great. I'm pretty sure that wasn't a uh, Wilhelm scream, but Go and get the other one. no, it wasn't a Wilhelm scream, but it was surprisingly close and equally cheesy. Now let's try it again, shall we? Who do you work for? <laughs> I'm just hanging around. You get the guard's attention by urinating through the cell door and I'll knock him out when he comes in. I got a knife. I got a gun. Four bullets in it. Okay, so strafing, strafing, moving forward. Can I like open these? I can lean. Fuck me leaning. I guess I can't open doors. What's a right click do? Right click is jump. What does enter do? Okay, I guess I can't open doors. Good to know. I see a doctor. How do I open doors? Oh, I get a little hand button at the bottom when there's something I can do. Let me go back and check. I gotta go find a door. Do I get a hand icon? No, I don't. Alright, good to know. Get a hand icon when I can do things. What is it? E? Is it enter? It's enter. Ah, there you are. Shackles that one to warm. Takes the other I shot you in the head. What is wrong with you? Dr. C, is everything alright down here? No! It's not all right. Your service is terrible. I didn't get any bread or water or not even a cup to ring along the jail bars. I get the feeling attacking him isn't really going to do me much good. I got one bullet left. Oh, there goes my bullet. Or 
Pete's sake, man, die. Oh, there's a button over here. I do not like the enter to use things. Can I have ammo? Health. Can I have ammo? Can I have... I can have a gun! Here, have gun! Does R reload? R does not reload. Okay, real quick, I'm going to take a look at the controls and see what I can do about um, changing reload to R and changing use to, I don't know, right click or something. So let's see here, misc. Wow, I can actually just suicide better than better than getting uh, taken in as prisoner, I guess. Activate, enter or F. Mouse two. So that's good. Is is there a reload? Reload weapon. Oh, it is R. I guess I was reloaded. Octung, baby. Okay, you know what? I'm changing use to E. No, I'm just gonna get used to it being right-click. I'm just gonna get used to it being right-click. Oh, crap. What's down here? I hear an alarm, and that kind of tells me I want to go the other way. Oh, hey, that just takes me back down here. Interesting. Can I go out? Ah! I want your gun. Give me your gun. Give me all of your gun. You're over there. I know you're over there. I saw you shooting at me. I kind of want his gun. Dang it. I guess I'm gonna go get his gun. All right, let's go get his gun. Let's go run out into the open where I can be shot by a lot of guys. I got grenades. I got MP40s. What is this? What are you? You are not important, apparently. All right, so I guess we're going up. Going up. When did you die? Oh, you know, maybe I came out of that door. Look at him go! Ooh, I got binoculars. There was a button to use binoculars, and I don't remember what it was. Ooh, I turned off an alarm. Go me. Now I can wander around at my leisure. And explore. And shoot, guys. I do not like how doors close behind me with that sound. It just scares me and, like, freaks me out. It makes me uncomfortable. That was smart. Just walk right off the ledge like that. Okay, so I guess I'm going this way. I don't like these big open areas. Guys are gonna, like, shoot me from up top and stuff. I kinda wanna hide and not get shot from everywhere. Is there fall damage? Someone in the chat asks. I don't know, but that friggin' hurt!
holy crap, that, like, really hurt. You monster. How dare you. Just freaking stand in there. Without a care in the world. Oh, I can climb up that. Now, there's, like, med kits and stuff in here, and I kind of want them. Because this guy decided to get, like, three rounds in on me. With a master rifle. I don't even know what a master rifle is. I'm not exactly up on my World War II weapons. Have I been this way? Okay, I can change weapons like this. There's the master rifle. There's that. Oh, I've been down here. Apparently I have. Maybe there will be health down here. Health, 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 health. Fine, be that way. Wow, really? That's a one-way door. All right, one-way door. Okay, let's go ahead and progress in the level or something. And not get shot in the back like four times. I'm doing a terrible, terrible jo job of, like, keeping up on my saving. Usually I'm a lot better about saving every four seconds. Can I save? Are there quick saves in this game? There are! Dude, there's quick saves! Well, a quick save, that's not really a quick save, but it's anywhere saving. Quick save is kind of a different thing, but still. Yes! I'm filled with, I'm filled with hope. You guys really do not like that floor. Give, give, give. Yes! I am feeling more vitalized already! There are guys down there, I know there are. Where are you? At this point, I'm, I'm actually having a great deal of fun playing this. Get plenty of ammo, get some health, I'm doing alright. Before I go in jumping down there or anything, I'm going to save there. I want to save over this one, though. Oh, I guess I have to just click over there. Wait, no. Click on that one. Guy's just coming from everywhere. just go outside? Yes, it does. Man, that would have been great if I could get that to land on him. I'm, like, really enjoying this, so if this is, like, how the whole game is gonna be, I'm all right with this. I am kind of missing Meinleben, though. I mean, that was clearly the best part of the original Wolfenstein 3D. Ah, you blended in with the background. And by blended in with the background, I mean you didn't actually blend in with the background. Man, they even got the meat! They even got the meals and stuff just kind of laying around. That's kind of great. Okay, that just goes there.
ham. Actually, it's bread and sausages. Okay, so that's not a dead end, because I can continue going this way. I get the feeling this is the way I'm supposed to go, so I'm gonna go back and try to go the other way. I leave no Nazis alive! I get, ooh, a Mauser rifle, what is that? That is that rifle, then there's a grenade. Oh, I guess that's what I got earlier and I just misread it. A Mauser rifle. That sounds a lot more like an actual rifle than a Master rifle. A Master rifle just sounds like something cheesy out of, I don't know, a video game. Video games. All right, let's go this way. I've got auto run turned on, so it's like I'm hitting the shift button to run and I'm not actually running any faster. Mission stats. I'm a winner! Now, one thing I did, um, I looked at a couple videos online just to kind of see what I was in for with this game. So I, like, knew very little. But what I did know is that, like, in the cutscenes and things, the game's actually got some kind of sense of humor. So that's kind of great. Like, it doesn't take itself completely seriously. And I think that's what I... I think that's one of the really great things about the original Wolfenstein 3D. Man, I was hoping for a cutscene or something. That's because the Major just doubled the guard around the dig site, again. Sounds like a bad case of nerves to me. Have you seen the Major lately? He looks positively ill. I know. According to Otto, he... Madame, Madame. Dang it! Dang it! I am not good at this stealth thing! I gotta go turn that alarm off. I must kill him. All right. Where did that alarm get sounded? Was it down here? Like, where was the button that they hit? You're not supposed to be able to hit me. I'm behind a chest high wall. Wait, I can lean. Look at me leaning. I also can't strafe. Also, you can't shoot, so it's... That was kind of great. You can't shoot while you're leaning? Oh, come on, I killed you. You were, like, flinching and falling over and everything. I gotta figure out where this alarm is. This alarm's getting annoying. This is clearly not the way to go to turn off the alarm. Use some health too. Are there any like food around? Fifteen more. Yeah, that's good. I'm good with fifteen more. Freaking alarm. Ooh. 
How do I break it? How do I break it? Ah! Oh, how do I break it? I know there's a kick button. What's the kick button? Um... G or X? Eat it, window! How do I get in there? Oh well, I guess we're going outside. Whoa, that is, that is a dead end. I really just want to make sure nobody's going to jump me. Oh, I've been in here, apparently. Blah! Oh, this is up top. This is where the dudes were. Can I turn the alarm off up here? It's getting annoying. Turn that crap off! Found a letter. Okay. Also, munitions were back here, and I do believe I just opened that up. So, heck yeah, munitions. Go get us some munition in. Health packs. I kind of don't want to waste them. Eat it, poster. Billboard, whatever you are. Did I get a new gun? Nope. Man, I want a new gun. Okay, let's actually get going somewhere or something. Darn it! Why can't I hit you? Are you still up there, or did you die? I think he died. Holy crap! You jerk. Again. Freaking Nazis. There's a couple of them. G 
Dieu I like their dialogue. That ought to do her. Ooh, giblets. Another letter. Come here. I don't know when the end of this level is going to be, and I really wanted to get to the end of the level, but we're kind of running out of time. So I may take a quick run ahead and be unnecessarily reckless. And see if I find anyone. Music changed. Why did the music change? Because a turret section. I will destroy all of your rocks. Oh, you're down there. Yay, turret sections! I don't mind turret sections as long as they're used, like, kind of sparing. Music change, so I guess the turret section's over. I was alright with that turret section. That wasn't so bad. Just kind of, hey, a turret. That's a thing. I'm gonna shoot guys with turrets. Have fun with that. Nothing over there. Oh, great. Now I'm lost. Well, seeing as I'm lost, now may be a good time to... call it a day. Because you'd think I was supposed to come out here... And then I came out here. Ow, 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 Heck of a time to have to reload there, secret agent man. Jeez, that guy's got a happy trigger finger. Yeah, let's end it on that note. Well, these have been, assuming I don't get, like, jumped from behind, these have been my maiden reactions to the Wolf Pack. The Wolf Pack containing Wolfenstein 3D, Spear of Destiny, and Return to Castle Wolfenstein. I will say, at the very least, the original Wolfenstein 3D and um, Spear of Destiny, despite that I've played them before, they haven't aged the best, if only for the control scheme. Um... So in that case, I would say those I'm a little more uh about, but I do remember I played the uh, Game Boy Advance version. I don't I'm sure there are more fantastic versions out there, but personally, I played the Game Boy Advance version and really enjoyed it. Controls were actually really nice. But um that said, Return to Castle Wolfenstein is actually a lot of fun. So until next time, everyone, I have... I've actually quite enjoyed this. Until next time, though, we'll check out something new.